So, at this point, Bernie Sanders is very unlikely to win the nomination unless Hillary gets indicted or somehow Bernie gets 67% of the remaining pledged delegates, which is about as likely as Bill Cosby getting a blind date. But the long-term outcome of the Bernie campaign, or more the ideas of the Bernie campaign, is what worries me a bit. Because I'm afraid that once Bernie fades from the spotlight, people won't necessarily have a role model type figure to look to, and they might start to feel as if, well, fuck it, nothing's gonna change because no one cares about what I'm saying. And I think the way we stop that is, we need to put a way bigger emphasis on winning Congress and the Senate, not to Democrats, or Republicans obviously, but to truly progressive left-wing people. That way we can actually get legislation passed that will change shit and not even just incremental, I incremental change. I mean, we've never really even had a left-wing government. We've had a right-wing and a moderate, but never a left-wing. I mean, Democrats aren't even that left-wing anymore. I mean, in the government, they're just they're just not fucking insane like the GOP. They're just moderate. So, I don't know why Bernie hasn't just come out and endorsed the brand new Congress movement so we could get that jump started and actually get people out voting in the uh, not presidential election. I mean, I would even, I, I honestly think we need a new party, separate from the Democrats and Republicans, which I guess the Green Party kind of is that, but they don't have the force that Bernie, or the movement that Bernie currently has. We need the left-wing revolution to really come to fruition with the new party seeking to win the presidency and Congress with the momentum Bernie has generated. Now, it's probably too late to do that this election cycle. But we need to start, which I know a lot of people have, but we need more. <laughs> uh, now, I also thought it would be interesting to look at what would happen with the possible Jill Steen, Bernie Green Party ticket, as Jill has reached out to Bernie saying she wants that, but hasn't gotten a response. Now, that would be a amazingly interesting scenario. There really is no telling how well the Bernie momentum would transfer over but I'm going to guess pretty well but even then that does make the situation of a GOP victory more likely so maybe if a Republican runs as an independent or third party and steals votes from Trump it wouldn't be too dangerous for Bernie to run with Jill? I don't know but it would be interesting and revolutionary and help to get rid of the two-party system by having a four-way presidential race so, yeah, that's just my little, uh, brief little commentary here. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. More videos, probably better videos as I figure out what I'm doing with this shit coming. And, yeah. Chuck!